In this video, we're going to look at how to check programs on your computer using Software Informer. The process for checking software is really easy. First, start Software Informer from the Start menu. Since I'm on Windows 7, I can simply enter Software Informer and click on the icon that appears. If this is the first time you have run the software, you will see this window appear. Software Informer gathers information about programs on your computer and then transmits them across the web so that it can check an online database and then tell you which programs are out of date. If you like, you can view the information that it's going to send by clicking here. So now we can see a list of programs that's going to be sent and list of drivers it's on this tab so forth and so on. OK, let's close Firefox and click on OK to transmit the data. Right, so after a short delay, Software Informer will show you this window here. Click on Yes. Your web browser will now open. We can now see a list of programs that Software Informer thinks are out of date. Note that it doesn't always get this right. For example, Trillion here. The update 42017 is actually a beta or test version that is of no interest to regular users. Still, you should probably investigate any programs that Software Informer suggests might be out of date. Click on a program's name to get more information. You can then download the latest version by clicking here or go to the program's home page to investigate further. In this case, on the Pigeon home page, we can see that the latest version is version 270 and that on this PC, if I were to start Pigeon, and go to help about I can see that this version is out of date. It's also possible to use the programs window to find out about possible updates. I'll just switch back to Software Informer here. Simply click on a program in the list. From the menu here you can start the program or uninstall the program or jump directly to the program's website. Again from here you can download the update directly from Software Informer or visit the official website. And that's all there is to using Software Informer. It's a great tool for helping with keeping your programs up to date, so give it a try today.